Stratton's is in the market town of Swatham in Norfolk, which is situated in the heart of the Brex, really, countryside. It wasn't built as a hotel, so it's one of those sort of tucked away, hidden, historic buildings that you find in all small market towns. That's sort of architecture, a bit of a gem. This one's a villa. It dates from really the early 1800s as it is now. And I think that's its unique selling point, that it's the architecture is just beautiful. Stratton's now is really a hotel a cafe, a restaurant, and a shop. And it's combining all those elements of what we set out to do when we first opened. I would say Stratton's is very eclectic because it's a mixture of um, paintings and art, uh, sculptures, uh, the things that we like, and period pieces, furniture, but it's also made of modern art because we think it's really important to actually uh, use the artists that are around us. So it has old and new, which I think is important to keep the building alive. It's not just rooted in the past, it is rooted in, in the present and sort of rolling forward. We do breakfast because we have residents staying with us in the hotel. And that's really about sort of putting local produce on the plate, sausages from a local pig farmer and all those things that have become very, very important that were important to us from day one. So we have an on-site cafe deli called Coco's. We also do afternoon tea service in the hotel. Afternoon tea is a big celebration and obviously we want it to be as important as the evening offering or the breakfast offerings. Dining continues in the evening in our after five eatery. More of our contemporary take on food, casual, delicious food to be enjoyed with friends in a very informal style. And of course, all the ingredients sourced from our fantastic array of local suppliers. Stratton's is actually situated within Norfolk, within the Brex countryside, and not everyone will be familiar with that, but it's 370 square miles of the most amazing landscape. There's super duper opportunities to get out into the countryside, very accessible countryside, be it heathland or be it forestry. So you can come, walk, run, cycle, come with a dog, and you're gonna really enjoy this place because there's lots to do 